so my name's Beth. Um, I've worked at the park for five years and I now manage the site. I started out in the Butterfly House where I was a zookeeper um, and then I worked my way up. My name's Joy Greenwood and I am, as for one year now, Chair of the Friends of Williamson's Park. Cedric Rathall, I just do a lot of work in the park. The little one is a Border Terrier and she's called Jem. So Williamson Park is set on a beautiful 54 acres of park and gardens which is listed. Um, it's also got a number of listed structures including the Ashton Memorial and the Edwardian Palm House. Um, it also has a, a cafe and a gift shop and we do a number of events throughout the year in the park. The park was taken back over by the local authority about 10 years ago. Um, and since then we've noticed, well, we've been working very hard to increase the offer to the visitor. Um, so we've recently seen the inclusion of meerkats and uh, common marmosets to the mini zoo area. We've been working hard to improve the, the landscape uh, of the grounds um, and through that we've, we've seen that the, the visitor numbers have increased so something must be working. <laughs> So the history of the park is quite um, extensive really, um, the, uh, the park itself was uh, an old quarry and it was bought by Lord Ashton who commissioned the build of a number of structures uh, within the park um, to include the Ashton Memorial um, which was built uh, in memory of his second wife Jessie and is now used for weddings and events. Um, and alongside that he built um, the Edwardian Palm House in around 1909, I believe it was finished. We are a charity and the object of Friends of Williams's Park is to promote for the benefit of the public, the preservation, care and improvement of Williamson's Park and its facilities in cooperation with its management and staff. We have ideas, but we have to run them past, past the park manager who you've seen and really we do try and help and work with the grounds maintenance staff. We work really closely with Lancaster City Council in the running of the park. Um, so the money comes from the taxpayer. Um, however, we work hard to, like I say, increase the offer and that increases our income generation um, and that lowers the operational cost. The reservoir apparently was made to actually um, have water in case the Moore Hospital caught fire because of course the buildings on the other side of the reservoir are the old hospital. The reservoir? which we wanted to make into a conservation area, dog free and people free, so it's not disturbed. That's a long term project. Yeah. Well, until about six years ago, the Friends group was moribund and it was revived about six years ago as oh. part of ourselves yeah and that's when it took off again and we started to raise money for events a lot of people come because we actually enjoy it we enjoy sort of working together anybody Absolutely. can join yeah. yeah anybody at all through the butterfly house admissions we have about 50,000 visitors um, which, is, which is increasing year on year. Um, throughout the rest of the park we predict about a quarter of a million. Yes, we have some people that come just because they like just gardening, mm -hmm. straightforward gardening, whereas there's a, quite a lot of other people who like making things. Yeah. I don't like gardening. 
Yeah. <laughs> I like making things. Williamson Park is really important to the city of Lancaster. Um, people who are from this area absolutely love it. Um, it means a lot to people. Um, the Ashton Memorial is um, a very popular destination for weddings, not only for local people, but for students coming in um, who then finish their studies, go home and then come back here to get married, come back for an anniversary, which is, which is nice. Um, but yeah, it, it means a lot. You can see it from everywhere. You can, it's the building you see on the motorway um, when you're on the way up to the Lake District and you think, what is that building? And when you come, you can see how much passion is put into this place um, and everybody enjoys, enjoys coming around here, yeah. The last question is, do you enjoy being with friends of Williamson Park? Yeah, <laughs> yeah we do. <laughs> and I think that's sort of shown by the fact that people turn up. Yeah. It's how much I say, to be perfectly honest. My wife died 12 months ago of cancer, and mm. this has become my second home. There's no ifs and buts about it. It just, it just keeps going. That's why I come, it's, it's, uh, it's important. And it's important, anybody who loses somebody, should come out and join something because it just makes one hell of a difference. Mm -hmm. it does.